There was once an old Sufi master who tended the mausoleum of a great Muslim saint famed for miracles. The grave was a focus for pilgrimage, and Muslims would come from far and wide to ask for their child to be healed or daughter to find a husband. Pilgrims would give him money and food, and so he was able to live comfortably. One day, Joha came to him and asked if he would teach him the Sufi ways of piety and service to Allah. The old Sufi master agreed. After some years, the old Sufi told Joha, It's time for you to go and find your own way. Take my donkey and go in the protection of Allah. So Joha departed and journeyed many weeks across the desert. Sadly, while on his journey, the donkey died, so he buried it in the spot it fell. As Joha sat on the grave, wiping his sweat away, a merchant passed by and saw him in his Sufi robes and turban, and assumed the grave was that of a saint. He immediately began to make supplication for the success of his business. Before leaving, he gave Joha some money. Joha was stunned, and before he could say anything, the man was gone. The merchant's business venture was a great success, and he returned home to tell others of the miraculous saint in the desert. People started making pilgrimage, and stories spread about the wondrous works of this saint. Joha felt too embarrassed to say anything, and he saw that it made people happy and gave them hope. So he gradually built an enclosure, which grew over the years, with lodging rooms for paying visitors. He was now highly respected and lived a very comfortable life. One night, Joha woke terrified and deeply remorseful for what he had done. He decided to return to the old Sufi and confess his sins. When he returned, he fell to his knees and tearfully confessed. The old Sufi master placed his hand on Joha's shoulder. Do not feel bad, my son. You see this grave I have tended for many years? It is the mother of the donkey I gave you.